Welcome back. This is going to be an almost personal reading for those who are in separation with your soulmate or twin flame. Okay, so all that I need to know about your person or your divine masculine. Okay, this is going to be a detailed reading. So very much straightforward as always. Bottom card with four of swords. You guys are focused on healing. Okay, I don't see you doing much. Moreover, in the past, you guys could have gone through the ups and downs. But yes, this month was difficult. Okay. But as soon as we move towards the 20th, maybe the 22nd, things are going to get a lot better. Okay. In terms of your major challenge, some of you guys could be holding on to options. Some of you guys just have a decision to make. You guys are wanting to choose or make that final decision for once and for all to either go in or go out completely. Some of you, it could be a past person and a new person. Moving on, in the past energy with four of pentacles. I don't see you guys doing much okay i think even in the past you were holding back majorly majorly focused on your goals okay working on your finances so yes some of you guys are focused on letting go of unhealthy eating habits or just unhealthy uh, situations moving into the future we have nine of wands which speaks about mainly no action from your side okay you're mainly going to focus on healing yourself some of you guys, uh, guys might be still possessive about the person, but you won't act it out. Okay. You'll still hold yourself back. Speaking about your challenge being two of pentacles. With the strength card here, I think majorly you want to hold back because you're making that decision once and for all to either go forward or completely reject it. Some of you guys could also be focused on another option. Strength card could also mean that some of you guys are finally getting over your biggest fears and you guys will come to that conclusion or you'd finally get closure to a situation that was left undone. You no longer want to stay codependent on them. Speaking about the past energy with four of pentacles, we have uh, clarified it with the king of pentacles, which speaks about finances have not gone quite well. You're also focused on saving money. Okay, you guys could be working really hard and you guys are waiting on those rewards. Trust me when I say this, those rewards are coming in. Okay, very soon. Thinking about your best case scenario as we proceed forward, we have nine of wands. Clarifying that further. We have the hanged man. So before your person takes action towards you, I do not see you initiating anything or reaching out or just trying to call them. Moreover, you want to release, you want to surrender. You're focused more on your healing journey. You're not so focused on that call. Okay, some of you guys, since there is no commitment, there is no uh, closure, there is no balance, some of you guys are just wanting to hold back because you see no purpose here. With two of cups here and six of uh, wands, I definitely see your past person coming forward in form of the near outcome and this person wants your attention. But majorly, you guys have been back and forth, okay? Uh, some of you guys could be waiting on their communication. Some of you guys are focused on healing. But regardless whether you're waiting or not, this person will approach you in a span of 5 to 8 days. Now, speaking about your person and moving on to the near future, the Page of Cups, you'll definitely be having attention. For some of you, your past person is definitely returning after ghosting you. Some of you, it could be a month. Some of you, it could be 8 months. Okay, but I'm, I'm getting strongly that someone who ghosted you is returning okay why are they returning seven of pentacles there's been silence from your side they're curious to know what's happening at your end you've been putting zero effort so that is also triggering them okay in terms of your emotions at this current moment the tower card you do not feel belonged you do not feel in peace with your life with whatever is happening you feel like this is not for you You've been slowly but surely awakening to the fact or realizing the fact that this relationship could some, be something that you need to get rid of. Even if the person is approaching you, you're not quite ready for it. Okay. In terms of that, how do you see yourself now? You see yourself as someone who's majorly should be focused on moving on to a better option or a better suitor. You guys might uh, be also working on healing yourself so that you could attract a good mate towards you you're mainly focusing on you i'm not so much getting you waiting on the past person it's like you're you're uh, hurt but you're mainly going to attract a better person better partner yes the past will return but just with two of pentacles here you will have choices okay in terms of outcome every ace of cups it usually speaks about a new relationship coming your way 
Okay, which is good. I'm moving on to your person now, the one on your mind. Let's speak about them. Their overall energy towards you. With Wheel of Fortune, this person has been back and forth. Okay, they haven't been um, very much focused on this relationship. They cannot stay away. They cannot stay with you. And with Six of Wands, they've been back and forth with their attention, with their intention. But this time, I believe strongly, top card being the Two of Cups, this person wants to initiate or uh, come back working on the uh, emotional connection. Okay, so which is very good, which is uh, very much something that might go in your favor if you're wanting this back. Okay, in terms of what are they bringing in your life this time? The Six of Pentacles, they are bringing in balance. Okay, usually I do not like the Six of Pentacles, but this time I do like it because bottom card we have Swords and top card we have is King of Pentacles. Which speaks about this person for a long time is wanting to be honest and real with you now. Okay, give me more. With Knight of Pentacles, this person wants something stable with you. Yes, they might be slow, but they are definitely coming in. Okay, in terms of their current intentions towards you. Current intention is to have your attention, is to possibly move things forward with you. I of Wands, they are not willing to give up on you. Moreover, they want to fight for this connection now. Okay, clarifying Five of Wands. Five of Pentacles. This person feels left out by you and they are not liking it. They did trigger you by giving you the silent treatment, but that backfired. Okay, but yes. What else do we see? With the Devil card, this person could have also been someone who tried to use their charm or their looks or their body to get your attention but this time you've been avoiding them okay in terms of what do they want with you now what they want is to heal and fix the relationship they definitely want to get back okay in terms of the temperance card what can you expect the uh, queen of pentacles this person is definitely looking forward to have a normal respectful balanced relationship okay and it uh, Queen of Pentacles, this person looks serious about getting back. Okay. In terms of that, what are their current feelings? They feel cautious. They are wondering how they need to proceed with this relationship. For some of you, this person may also be feeling like they cannot be themselves around you. They feel like they have to put a mask. Uh, they are majorly afraid that you will not accept them fully. Um, and um, yeah, they are also guilty for what they have done to you in the past. So they cannot fully reveal themselves. For some of you, this person may also have a hard time trusting you. So they might have a fear that you could already be talking to someone else or you could be focused elsewhere. Okay, so that is also triggering them. Regardless of how much they are in love with you, this person will have a hard time completely opening up to you. Okay, so yes, some of them also feel like they have to be honest and real with you and break their eyes to get back. Thinking about why do they really want you? What's the major reason? Page of Pentacles. You make them feel good. Okay, you always have plots to offer. With King of Cups, there's lots of emotions connected, emotions involved. And with the High Priestess, they share a connection with you that they cannot possibly explain, you know. And it's very powerful, very pure, very much something that they would want to continue with. Okay, in terms of where this is going. Ace of Wands, you're definitely moving towards a new start. You're definitely moving towards coming together. Okay, in form of that, what do we have for those waiting on a new person? With Five of Swords, I believe the new person is kind of giving you the anxiety because they've been uh, holding back a little. The Eight of Swords, a part of you also feels a little caught up, not ready. Okay, sometimes uh, even the smallest things that they do could trigger you. That's because you haven't healed. Okay, but yes, in terms of what do they have for you? With strength card, this person is still figuring it out. Okay, where is this moving? For the Ten of Cups, if you're waiting on a new person, if, even if it goes through some sort of ups and downs, August and later part of uh, September, things are going to get back. Okay, for most of you, I see you uh, getting in a relationship by around September or October. But yes, you're moving towards stability or moving towards togetherness. Okay. In terms of that, what's the major realization going to be? The one on your mind. 
five of cups they miss you they cannot possibly live without you uh, things seem all messed up they feel empty the two of wands they they know that they'll have to come forward now okay in terms of major blockage blockage is just like i told you queen of cups having to open up on an emotional level okay in terms of action and priority action on a death card definitely want to change their ways okay in terms of priority right now priority right now is pentacles or uh, ten of pentacles and three of swords which speaks about they want to first off fix what is broken and have a normal stable relationship with you okay those who are dealing with air sign let's see what's coming up if you're dealing with an air sign okay the star card the air sign definitely wants to work things out with you but the pentacles here they want a stable relationship and with ace of pentacles they will come forward okay and this relationship has a very high chance of going forward okay and uh, those who are dealing with water sign the hierophant card this has been a learning experience for most of you some of you you could be dealing with someone who's either your junior or you're dealing with a boss figure with the eight of cups emotionally they could have walked away in the past to the world card this person is definitely coming back okay sorry about that those who are dealing with fire signs four of cups this person is messed up without you depressed with ten of swords uh, they want to end the silence and come forward and you will have a restart okay 20th and onwards is when i feel but yes in terms of those who are dealing with earth signs earth sign already has uh, been making plans in terms of how they need to approach with queen of wands for sure this person will come forward and with the hanged man and lovers this person will choose you if they had choices final card of advice final card of advice we have is two of swords do not hold on to options for too long okay and top card we have is seven of wands i think most of you guys are blocking your own blessings by overthinking or letting your past affect your present okay we have seven of action for you in terms of spiritual message you are being called upon to claim your personal power feel confident as your angels will give you the strength to say no when it's the right thing to do for yourself your struggle may actually stem from an unresolved inner conflict rather than a conflict with others okay in terms of that let's move on to messages i'm sorry is the first message and moving on we have right love wrong time wrong place of you even if you met the right person the timing was wrong and things kind of fell apart but this time it's coming back on sex on my mind and uh, you are my source of happiness and light so that is all i have for you for the next 72 hours okay, this is going to resonate with people who are in a spiritual or deep sorted relationship okay those who are seeking my advice i i believe most of you guys will come back together but give it time time frames can change right so give it time okay be patient but if you still have issues you could go for a personal reading to get more clarity okay you could definitely go to the link below and check your reading all those who want to check your individual signs i've done almost every sign this month uh, for the month's end you could definitely check down the link below or you could go to the playlist for july thank you so freaking much please do like the video before leaving okay thank you